Hello guys, so today I want to make a little video about an issue that I'm having with uh, Windows on my Mac. The issue is, whenever I turn on this computer, it comes with a, with a message. It says, boot MGR is compressed, press control, alt, delete to restart and stuff like that. The computer is off, I think. The computer is turned off because I want to show you guys the issue. So we're going to power it on. And let me demonstrate to you what happens whenever I turn on my, my iMac. So let me show you. Hello, my screen's a bit dirty. I know, I'm gonna comment about that. It says, boot MGR is compressed, press control, delete to restart. So if you actually press control, delete, then it does not do anything, obviously. So basically what I have with me right here is a Windows 7 Ultimate install disk. Um, I burned it with Windows 7 on it. Um, now this is gonna be important because I need to stick this into the computer to repair this Windows installation. So basically what we're gonna do right now is force shut down the computer. So I'm gonna hold down the power button on the back and the computer should shut down. Okay, now I think it's shut down now. Basically what I'm gonna do now is power on the computer and I hold down the option key and that will let me select the, through the boot picker. You'll hear the boot up chime and then eventually you're gonna see the boot picker. This will give me the choice if I wanna boot up Windows or Mac OS. Now we're not gonna do any of those because we're gonna stick in my own Windows 7 Ultimate install disk right here. Just like this, so I'm gonna put it in. And now it took the disk, and now eventually, on the screen, should pop up with the uh, install disk. There, it took forever. Okay, I don't know if I should boot off of Windows or EFI boot. Okay, I'm gonna guess Windows. Okay, I pressed enter, and now it takes a little while for it to load the files correctly. Okay, then we get a black screen, um, and then press any key, so I'm pressing any key, and then now it's going to boot up into my own DVD. There we go! That is what we like to see. It says Windows is loading files, and this should let us fix the issue. So I'm going to show you guys what to do whenever we get into the install disk. So, yeah. So now, as you guys can see, um, we're not booting off of the hard drive, we're booting off of the CD that I just made. Um, and it looks like everything is working. So I see the Windows 7 background. Now, I don't think my mouse is going to work because, oh, it does work. That's pretty surprising. So my mouse does work, um, even though there's no drivers somehow. That's pretty interesting. At this point, we're going to select the language. This is good. Hit next. Now, instead of clicking on install now, which is what you would do if you were installing Windows, we're gonna click on repair your computer. So we're gonna click on that. And then now it's gonna search for Windows installations. So this is my operating system. So what we're gonna do now is click on load drivers. So I'm just gonna click on that right here. And then we're gonna press okay. Okay, this is where we should be. So basically here, I believe we click on computer and then we find whichever disk we're on. So I'm on this one. This is my main C drive. I'm going to right click it and click on properties. If you guys can see this, it says compress this disk to save disk space. We're going to uncheck this. This is what the issue is. And then we're going to click on apply. After we do this, we're going to click on OK. And we're going to click on OK. I'm going to try to power it off right now. And we'll see if Windows loads. If it doesn't, then we'll need to try this process again. So let's power it on. Okay, I think it's booting off the hard drive. This is very good. So it says starting Windows. I think I fixed the issue. Oh, wow. I think I fixed the issue. Okay, welcome. Oh, Windows is back. Oh, yes. Oh my God, it's gonna launch up every application I have for some reason. Let me eject the hard drive, or the flash, or whatever, the TVT. The whole operating system is fixed. As you can see, all my files are still here, which I'm extremely, extremely happy about. Um, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.